Jesus is known as the light of the world, so when Morris and Debbie Lake suggested a light show at the cathedral on Easter Monday to take away some of the pain associated with coronavirus, it seemed like a very good idea. All good ideas involved preparation, however. Hymns and songs had to be chosen to give some context to the show, and the lights had to be correctly positioned against the tower and the north nave wall. Setting up the equipment in the afternoon was hard work, but everything needed to be checked. The weather had turned cold and a breeze had sprung up, with the promise of rain later, so conditions were not exactly ideal for getting everything right. Several passers-by stopped to find out what was going on, but eventually, after the lights had been tested under the watchful eye of Sir Marlon and the production director, the technical work was finally declared complete. All that remained was to wait for dusk, and to hope that as the clouds gathered overhead, the rain would hold off long enough for the show to go ahead. Eventually, seven o'clock arrived, the weather had improved slightly, and several passers-by gathered to watch, socially distanced, of course. By the time the first hymn, Love Divine or Love's Excelling, was played aloud, cars were beginning to slow down to get a glimpse of the show. What follows should give you some idea of the celebration, although we can't play some of the hymns for copyright reasons. It was a good public display of faith at Easter, so thank you, Morris and Debbie.
song.